Hi guys, so welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna learn chapter 4 chemical equations stoichiometry and focus on 4.1 chemical equations. So at the end of this lesson, you should be able to write and balance chemical equation by inspection method. So balancing chemical equation can be done by two methods, inspection method for non-redox equation and also for redox equation we can use ion electron method. Now let's write inspection method. Okay, ini yang biasa kita buat di sekolah bani. So first step kita adalah you must list down all the elements on the left and right hand side of the equation. And then baru kita can start balance lah. And you have to balance starting from metal, then non-metal, hydrogen, then baru oxygen. And just remember L, B, M and M, H, O. L, B, M and M, H, O. Now let's try this first example. X, E plus F2 produce XdF6. So first thing kita list down dulu all the elements ada Xe dengan F saja. And on the left hand side ada 1 Xe, ada 2 F. On the right hand side ada 1 Xe dan 6 F. Now kita sudah list down. Now it's time to balance. So remember LB M and M H O. So kita balance M metal. Do you have metal? No metal. So proceed. Kita ada Xe. Xe sudah balance 1 and 1. Now kita fokus on fluorine. Fluorine ada Dua darab tiga, so tiga kita letak koefisien dekat depan F2, and then dia pati enam enam sudah, so sudah balance. Ada orang tanya, bolehkah kalau saya buat begini F2 tu saya tukar jadi F, saya padam tu dua saya tukar enam sana, bolehkah begitu? Jawapannya tidak boleh. Jangan sekali kali buat macam tu. Siapa kita buat? Okay, kembalikan seperti asal. F2 dia sudah bagi dalam soalan tetap F2, kita just tambah koefisien depan dia saja balance. And moving on to the next example. We got silver plus H2S produce Ag2S plus H2. Now remember L, B, M and M, H, O. So list down all the elements first on the left and on the right hand side of the equation. We got Ag, silver, H and also S, sulfur. Dua-dua ada di sebelah kiri dan kanan. And then, kita senarikan berapa bilangan dia. On the left hand side ada satu Ag, dua H and satu sulfur. On the right hand side, kita ada 2 Ag, 2 H dan 1 Sulfur. Now, let's balancing them starting from metal, M. So, kita ada silver as the metal here. So, ada 1 silver dekat kiri, 2 silver dekat kanan. So, on dekat kiri kita darab 2 dekat depan. Dulu. Letak koefisien 2 and now 2 dan 2 sudah. Okay, balance Ag. Now, moving on to non-metal. Kita ada Sulfur, on the left ada 1 dan 1. Hydrogen pun 1, 2 dan 2. Oh, okay, balance. Okay, next example, we got sodium carbonate, Na2CO3, plus HCl, hydrochloric acid, to produce NaCl, plus CO2, carbon dioxide, and H2O, water. So, kita list down semuanya ada Na, carbon, Cl, H, and O on both sides. Now, kita tengok berapa bilangan dia. On the left-hand side dulu, ada 2 Na, 1 carbon, 1 Cl, 1 halogen, and 3 oxygen. On the right-hand side, ada 1 Na, 1 C, 1 Cl, 2 H, and A. Ada berapa oksigen? Ada 2 plus 1. Jadi ada 3 oksigen. Alright. Now, selepas kita sudah list down, now kita balance. Balance apa? M, N, M, H, O. So, metal dulu. Metal ada Na saja di sini. So, ada 2 dekat kiri, 1 dekat kanan. So, dekat kanan kita kena darab 2 dekat Na Cl. Automatic, Cl juga akan jadi 2 di sana. Alright, so habis sudah metal, now let's move on to non-metal. Non-metal yang pertama ada karbon di sini, kita ke turutan lah. So, karbon ada satu-satu, so sudah balance. So, next kita ada lagi klorin. Okay, klorin dekat kanan sudah ada dua. So, dekat kiri itu kita tenderap dua dekat HCl. So, automatic H pun jadi dua. So, balance sudah klorin. Moving on, kita balance H. H ada dua kiri, dua kanan. Balance. So, oksigen ada tiga kiri, tiga kanan. Balance. Selesai. Now test yourself with these three equations. Just list, balance, balance what? M and M, H, O. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.